Virgo, say my lovies. What's going on, my love, love, loves? How are you guys today? It's your girl, Empress Meek, sending you a multitude of love, light, and spiritual guidance and wisdom, as always. I thank you guys, each and every one of you, for clicking on your video today. These are your daily oracle and tarot card messages. Let's go ahead and dive in. Thank you guys for all my new subscribers. Hey, y'all. Hey, welcome. Thank you for joining our tribe. We love when new family members come and join the family thank you guys for your like share and subscribe once again and your beautiful comments down below your donations i really appreciate you guys so much so let's go ahead and get into it holy spirit holy angels ancestors and spirit guys give me clear messages from my virgo lovies thank you for all you do in the divine realm blocking and binding all negative energy entities witchcraft and wickedness thank you for victory in every situation we may face abundance and overflow and giving us messages messages of love, spiritual wisdom, and guidance. Amen, amen, amen. So, Virgos, angel of clearing, your time of waiting and confusion will soon be over. This is what your angels want you to know. So, your time of waiting and confusion will soon be over. We're going to find out why that card is here. Let's see what's going on for my Virgo. Virgo, let's go ahead and tap into your overall energy and see what message the Spirit wants to give you on today. Let's see what your overall energy is right now. What's happening in Virgo's energy? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, and Spirit guys. Show Virgo clear messages about what's going on in their surrounding energy. What messages can I give Virgo today to make their path a lot brighter and their low a lot lighter? Show me clear messages for my Virgos. What's going on with Virgos today? First card out, two of fire. It says you've come into your own. New partnerships or contracts continue to move forward. All right, Virgo. So with this card, I'm getting that spirit is encouraging you to keep going. All right. For some of you, if you have any type of feeling of doubt or... um. Maybe feeling like you can't accomplish something or something won't come to you. It's coming. This is proof right here that it's coming. Spirit is confirming for you that it's coming. So continue to move forward, Virgo. Whatever you're doing, my loves, you are on the right path. And things are working out for you. So keep going. Spirit is telling you to keep going. The Two of Wands is talking about you making a decision to move forward. It's after the Ace of Wands energy, a brand new idea or a motivated new beginning. So Spirit is saying, keep going. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, and Gods, what else is here for Virgo for the surrounding energy? The Empress. All right, so you have this Empress energy surrounding you and a decision to, um, um, to move forward, forward movement. So the Empress, Archangel Gabriel is here. Lavish abundance. Give birth to your dreams. Nurture yourself and others. So I feel like you have this lavish abundance around you. This energy of lavish abundance around you. Money in reserve. I feel like doors are opening for you for financial um, overflow. Blessings are coming into your life. And I feel like, Virgo, you deserve this. You've been working hard. A lot of y'all been praying so much for this. And it's finally coming. Some of you are very secure and stable financially, okay? A whole lot of money, okay? Um, and for those of you who are working towards it, Spirit is saying, keep going. These um endeavors that you're having is going to pay off. New partnerships are going to be coming in for you. This Empress energy, you being pregnant with new ideas, possibilities, and opportunities, that's here for you, okay? So don't, don't stop. Keep going. Angel of Clearing, it says your time of waiting and confusion will soon be over. So for those of you who are still waiting, hoping, and wondering when your day is coming, baby, it's here. So keep moving. Spirit says something beautiful is about to happen for you. It, a lot of you are already walking in this abundance. All right, what else for Virgo spirit? The lovers. It says intimate relationships. Carefully weigh your decisions and good health. So if some of you guys um have been waiting to heal in your body, some of you could be having any ailments, pains, or whatever, you're going to be healing from that. Some of you are bringing in an intimate relationship. I feel like you're getting options. You've been manifesting options because you don't want to be alone. So Spirit is saying, just be careful weighing your options. Choose wisely is what I'm getting with this lover's card, okay? 
So the lovers also talks about good news and it talks about you being in alignment. So let's see. Ten of air. No, two of cups talks about you being in alignment. Carefully weigh your decisions for the lover card. But for this deck, it's representing good health and intimate relationships. Okay, so ten of air. So choose wisely who you sleep with too. This is what I'm getting. I went right back to this card. Spirit sent me right back. Okay, so choose wisely who you sleep with. All right, and then we have Ten of Air, the end of a difficult situation. Embrace the change and expect things to get better now. Recovering from addiction for somebody also. So somebody is giving up weed, giving up drinking, whatever the case may be. You're letting go of whatever addiction. Some of you were addicted to a person or outcome. You're letting go of that also. So let's find out. A complex decision, the need to do research, stop procrastinating. All right, Seven of Cups. So stop procrastinating. There's some type of complex decision that you should be making. All right, take your time and choose wisely, but move forward. Don't procrastinate. Spirit says, go ahead, do this. All right, let's see why these cards are here, my lovies. But don't say my love. Hey, hey, my loves. Look at you. Looking good. Big Virgo energy. Some of you guys are bosses, managers, leaders. I love it. Virgo, you're being very serious right now about these decisions that you're making and about what's happening in your life. So let's see. Why is the two of fire here for my Virgo lovies? Why is the two of fire here for Virgo? Page of Wands. Okay. So new partnership. A new contract, a new opportunity. Spirit is saying continue to move forward. The page of wands is a divine spark. It also is talking to you about ambition, enthusiasm, and also to be cautious. All right? So take caution in making this decision, but move forward. Be enthusiastic about it. It's talking about opportunities, okay? Also, somebody could have a fire sign that is coming toward them or somebody that's thinking about you passionately. We see the lovers here. So be careful in your decision making, but definitely move forward. You have a new opportunity here. So the Empress, lavish abundance, give birth to your dreams, nurture yourself and others. What else is here for Virgo? Somebody is about to give you an offer. Somebody is about to be sweet talking you, being charming. Okay. Okay. <laughs> This is also creativity. So some of you guys have an idea that you're moving forward toward, like you're really doing this and it's going to work out for you. All right. This is also you getting guidance, a connection. This could talk about a romantic proposal also. Some of you are just coming into your intuitive gifts and you're also learning because this page is actually practicing magic in this cup, illusion. All right, so this page is practicing their magic, exercising their new gifts, trying to see how well they, how good they are at it, out of, at bringing things into fruition. So be careful, okay? But I feel like this is some type of um, energy that wants to pursue you, somebody that wants to be closer to you. Show me more. What else is going on here? We have justice, all right? So there's some type of justice, something a fair judgment in your favor, something that you have been waiting for to work out for you, lavish abundance. Some of you guys are definitely upgrading your life right now. I, fi I still feel like there's more people that are gonna receive this good news, but a fair judgment is here. So I feel like also somebody could be dealing with a Libra, but somebody is thinking about you. Somebody's gonna come and talk to you. Um, somebody is gonna make you an offer. Okay, so let's see what else with the justice card. Six of Wands energy. So a recognized victory. Okay, with this intimate relationship or carefully weighing your decisions and good health. Somebody is healing or whatever this situation is and you're worried about if you're going to heal from it. Yes, you are going to heal from it. But this is a recognized victory. This is triumph and this is people cheering you on. So I feel like something good is turning around for you the will is turning in your favor and i feel like this good news good opportunities and blessings are coming in for you making you feel really really good we got the 10 of air here all right the end of a difficult situation embrace the change and expect things to get better now recovering from an addiction so whatever this is that's been hindering you you are gonna rise to the top 
I feel like you're going to be triumphant in this and it's going to be a public recognition. So you're about to get public recognition for this. Something is going to happen where you're going to be recognized. People are going to see the blessing, the upgrade, the gift from the universe for whatever this is that you were dealing with um, or just for you putting in good into the universe, just for you being faithful to spirit and staying firm in your beliefs. Something good is going to happen. Okay, you stood your ground here. So the end of a difficult situation, show Virgo what they need to see. Wow. Magician and the star. Let's go. Okay. So I feel like Virgo with this magician energy, finally, you have all the tools you need to succeed and excel in the way that you've been manifesting, that you've been dreaming of. This is your dreams coming true. I feel like you did it, Virgo. For a lot of you, you have done it. And now publicly, you're going to be recognized for this. I feel like spirit is blessing you in abundance. You got the empress energy on the board. So lavish abundance, pregnant with possibilities. Everything you touch turn into gold. This is you being extremely successful and you're able to be proud of yourself. And not only that, you have a lot of people that love and support you. And these people are going to be rooting you on every step of the way. So Virgo, get ready to embrace this beautiful gift from the divine. Spirit has something amazing for you. You got the Empress energy at the bottom of the deck, okay? And the High Priestess, all right? So holding your holding your visions close to your heart. Not really telling everybody everything that you're doing, all right? And the Empress energy. This is you knowing that whatever you seek, you'll get. This is you believing and trusting in all of your ideas and your endeavors, being very confident. This is the emperor rules, rules, um, kingdoms. The empress stands by the emperor and rules kingdoms. So you're a boss. I feel like it's your inheritance. It's in your bloodline to be a leader, to be successful, to be wealthy, to be abundant and prosperous. All right. This is mind, body, and spirit. Okay. So, and tangible items as well. So walk in this energy, Virgo. I feel like spirit is definitely giving you your just due. I feel like everything that's happening for you, you deserve it. Wow, this is beautiful energy. So now let's tap in a little bit deeper. Let's see what these people coming towards you want to say and why this energy is here. So Virgo, we have the page of wands energy. Let's see what this page of wands energy is coming towards you um, saying or what does this represent? I feel like I feel like this represents you being passionate about whatever you're doing. So show me page of wands for Virgo. Page of cups. All right, so this is good news. Okay, this is some good news coming towards you. Somebody thinking about you, this is also an offer. Somebody may want to get a little closer to you, may want to get to know you. But we got Page of Cups here. So what's the Page of Cups clarified by? Nine of Swords. All right. So it's somebody here that wants to make you an offer, but they're stressed out about something. Show me the Page of Cups. Sorry about the noise, guys. So it could be some type of confusion or option. Somebody trying to choose wisely. I feel like these are options coming in for you. More than one opportunity. And Spirit is telling you to choose wisely. I feel like that's exactly what um, what your cards are telling you to do. Um, we have the lovers. And it's saying, um, choose carefully. Weigh your decisions with the lover's card. So it's going to be an opportunity for somebody here. So you got options coming in, Virgo. <laughs> so I feel like you're looking better. You're feeling better. You're standing out more. So these people are coming towards you. For somebody, though, they're stressing. With the nine of swords, this could be a water sign, stressing. Somebody telling you whatever you want to hear. I feel like somebody's gaslighting you. This person is depressed. Definitely depressed. Show me nine of swords. Emperor in reverse. This is somebody abusing their power. You see how the empress came? So this person is very flighty, very underhanded, I feel like. Yeah, be careful about this energy. This could be somebody that is supposed to do something for you, 
somebody is nine of swords here so i feel like you're communicating with this person or this person is being dishonest maybe selling you a dream whatever the case may be it's going to be justice in your favor i feel like you're going to take this to court for some of you or whatever this case is justice is here for you so even if this is a a, a job a person a landlord or a person that is of high authority trying to abuse their power and come on to you or whatever the case may be things are going to work out in your favor okay show me justice for virgo yeah you're about to be able to put down these burdens so whatever this is that's weighing on you or getting on your nerves or somebody trying to create issues for you it's going to be over right it's going to be over and this is going to be a recognized victory the public is going to see this so show me the recognized victory for virgo ten of cups you're going to enjoy this this is your wish fulfillment and also a lot of happiness added on to that so something is going to happen to make you very very happy it's going to be some type of public recognition here all right people showing you that they have your best interests at heart they love you um they wishing you the best in everything so i like this energy for you virgo this is very positive okay show me the burden that virgo is going to be able to put down what's the ten of wands Woo, a recognized victory, honey. You got justice, recognized victory, recognized victory, 10 of cups. So I feel like this, this emperor in reverse is gonna receive some type of karma. Hold on one second, y'all. Sorry, I dropped our card. Let me see if I can put this down a little bit more. Okay, so this empress in reverse, I mean, this emperor in reverse is gonna receive some type of karma, I feel. But let's see what's going on with this empress in reverse, emperor in reverse. What's happening with the emperor in reverse spirit? What's going to happen with this person abusing their power? They're already depressed. They already have issues. They're already depressed. So show me the emperor in reverse. Three of cups. You're going to, this person is going to witness you celebrating. Knight of cups. Sneaky. So I feel like this person is going to get caught, to be honest. I feel like this person is definitely going to get caught. With this Knight of Cups coming in and out, telling you whatever, I feel like they're going to get caught. They're sneaky, hiding something, deceptive. So I feel like it's some type of deceptive energy. They know they're supposed to come towards you and do something. And with these cups pouring out, I feel like whatever this is, they could be telling somebody. Like this is a main person and they're pouring into this main person. So I feel like they're, this person is like, uh, it could be a water sign, but they're deceptive. But I feel like spirit is definitely about to deal with this person, honestly. And I feel like they're not going to have any choice but to do the right thing because justice is here. And they're sneaky and their sneakiness is going to catch up with them right here so either way virgo this is you right here getting a victory this is you getting a victory ten of air the end of a difficult situation is over expect positive change so that's what's going to happen here seven of water what does virgo need to make a decision on oh my gosh virgo to be honest i already finished this reading i had to just keep going so make it a little bit longer and give you a little more information. Patience. I mean, oh, be patient. All right. But Page of Pentacles energy, seven of water. So spirit wants you to make a decision. Do something. Make a decision. Um, you're supposed to be going somewhere, traveling somewhere. It could be an appointment or anything like that that you may be forgetting about. Spirit wants you to make a decision to go ahead and move towards something you're supposed to be doing. Stop procrastinating. So I feel like you keep procrastinating, dragging your feet, but you need to do it. Maybe it's a purchase that you need to do, something that you planned on starting that you haven't started yet. Spirit said, go ahead and do it. Stop dragging your feet, okay? So it's something here that you said you were going to do or you're supposed to be doing. It's time. All right, let's get you some positive messages for your heart space from Spirit. Let's see what Spirit wants to tell you on today, my lovely Virgos. Thank you guys for being here with me. I love you and I appreciate you so much. Let's see what's happening. For my Virgo. Hey, my lovelies. Show me clear messages, please. What is happening here for Virgo? Spirit, what do you want to tell Virgo for their heart space to balance their energy today? What do you want to tell Virgo?
All right. So Virgo, and let's get your positive. Let's get what you should do in all this. Spirit, what do you want Virgo to do in all this? What should Virgo, how should Virgo move? Take action. Wow. Spirit said, chase the money. Look, <laughs> take action. It's something that can make you a lot of money. So this is you focusing on your choices, continuing to go after your bag, focus on everything you're doing. So I feel like just keep doing everything that you're doing. Some of y'all have an opportunity to make a lot of money. Spirit says, stop procrastinating. Don't drag your feet. Let's get it, Virgo. Let's get it. All right? You're on a journey of discovering your life's purpose is what Spirit wants you to know. Also, all the right things will come to you in the most unexpected ways. All right? And then let go. I mean, really let go. There's something better on the horizon. So this is what Spirit wants for you. So let go. Trust that something better is coming towards you. Something better is going to happen, all right? It's on its way to you, all right? So be open to receive this, Virgo. All right, I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here with me. Thank you for all the love and support. If you want to book your personal reading, you can book it at closer than number two, mydestiny.com. If you want to email me and you have any questions, you can email me at closer than number two, mydestiny, the number one at gmail.com. Thank you guys. I will talk to you later on our next video. Bye, my loves. Bye, Virgo.